Hello and welcome to GOT365's News Bulletin. I am Susan Gomes and these are the headlines. Infamous Nagmore Junction sewage works threaten house collapse. Local MLA promises repair and completion of project as soon as possible. UPI goes global. Sri Lanka Mauritius joined France as India's unified payment interface goes international. Goa to experience dry weather until February 18. Fog or haze likely at isolated spots in coming days. And now for the news in detail. The Nagmore Junction in Margao has once again become a topic of discussion due to the ongoing excavation for sewage works, which has placed a nearby house on the verge of collapse. Residents of the affected household now live in fear. The junction has been notorious for the sewage works that have been going on for the past seven years. Here's our reporter Ramesh Naik Raut with the details. <laughs> सात वर्षानी रोड जो किल्लो रिपेयर तो आज पोर्ट फोड़ून आनिक तेका वनवास लेकर आया था आज ये जय सिवरेजी खातिर भाई जय रोड डिगिंग के लिए जय फोल्डर जय चैम्बर घुसपा के लिए यहाँ पर ये अतिक करूँ आज के रोड जय आया था रंगचान गल्ले जंक्शन आओ इलाज इतने बंद करूँ उड़े लाने लोकाई के � सगलो लोग जो आसान है एक्टिव जाले के यहाँ सा अंगा फायर भी गेड़े ओपा में ना अंगा एम्बुलेंस ओपा में ना अंगा खंची एक फक्त वस्ता ती फक्त एक बाइक अन बाइक का शो आनी खोई ना आनी लोका ऐतर जाले एक मुड़गो चान वो सों पट्टा ना ले त्यालावली चान त्यावड़े नियोपा पट्टा अंगा लोका ने मागला बिकी जा बिकी इंदर हंगी जा यह काम करना जाले हम मुकाली की तरह साथ यहाँ में करता ले मुनादी। The owner of the house affected by the sewage works has expressed fear, claiming that there has been no action from the authorities despite several complaints. The situation has forced them to live in fear in their own house. They now feel unsafe in their own house as the danger of potential collapse caused by the nearby digging for sewage works looms over them. मैं तुम्हें सांगले भी तेंगा मागेर मैं आतो फाले मॉल लेजर कित करता मैं आते मोदी लेटर गाला पुलिसी लेटर दिला मोदी को दिला लेटर ओके अन्य पुलिसे दिला किस सांगला अते कोई कोई तुम जाले एरी ये ले आतो सांगले in response to the situation, Navelim MLA Ullas Tuekar has assured that the ongoing sewage works will be expedited and completed as soon as possible. Recognizing the impact of the works on the nearby house and its residents, the MLA also promised to take necessary measures to repair and fix the affected house. Collapse can nice up there. Kitty to me as a young girl. I I was able to get a lot of work, and I was able to get a lot of work. I was able to get a lot of work, and I was able to get a lot of work. 
जर बेगिन काम करना जो कसर पड़ सकता है इंस्ट्रक्शन के डेमेज काम कर सात वर्ष जाए बंद ना सर गर्षा करीत आ काम डिले जाने मशीन भाजपा एक रमेश नायक राउत मनीष परब एंड निखिल जलमी फॉर गोवा थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव स्टैग्नेंट वॉटर एट गांव सवाड़ा मापसा हेज बिकम अल्थ हजार फॉर नियर बाय रेसिडेंट The water stagnating for several days coupled with garbage dumped in it has become a breeding ground for mosquitoes and other pests and has also reportedly contaminated some local wells. Here's our reporter Nitiksha Gaonkar with the full story. सद्या आसा मापसा गांवसा वाड़ हंगा पड़ा शकता जैसे हंगा खुबी शेत आंगा जे रस्तर साको बनला थो हा शान उदक साटन उरले आसा इतले जीव जंतु हा उदकान कुजले आसा खाण वास निर्माण जो आसा तेज हंगा खुबसो बिल्डिंगो ये कारण लोग हंगा हाड़ा डेब्रीज डम करता तेज गार्बेज डम करता हंगा जर पड़ा शकता जैसे उदक जे आसा साटन उर हंगा खाण वास निर्माण जो आसा हि एरिया आसा हि रेजिडेंशियल एरिया तेज खुबसे लोग हंगा रहा हा गांवसा वाड़ चढ़ कर चढ़शा लोक बायो आसा अशे आयपा ये कि हंगा सर लोक बायो हम कॉन्टेमिनेट जो आसा खीर खे उदक साटन उरते आज खे तरी क्लीन जा जो गा आसा है उदकान हो क्लीन कर आज गरज आसा बिकॉज पड़ा शकता कि इतने आजार आज खे खे तरी डेंग्यू पसरला खे तरी चढ़ रोग निर्माण जो खीर खे तरी क्लीन आज कर गरज आ Nitiksha Gaukar, Manish Parab and Nikhil Jalmi for Goa 365. We shall take a short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. In a major stride towards globalizing India's digital payment system UPI, the Unified Payments Interface has expanded its reach beyond national borders a week after launching the system in France UPI has now been launched in Sri Lanka and Mauritius yes the latest on the ground breaking development just a week after its launch in France UPI has now found its way into Sri Lanka and Mauritius Prime Minister Narendra Modi virtually joined Mauritian Prime Minister Pravin Jugnauth and Sri Lankan President Ranil Wickremesinghe to witness the launch event marking a new era of digital collaboration. 
During the launch event, not only did UPI make its debut in these nations, but rupee cards were also introduced in Mauritius, further cementing India's influence in the fintech space globally. India's visiting Sri Lanka and Mauritius can now use UPI to make payments, while Mauritian travellers to India will have the same privilege. The extension of rupee services not only enables Mauritian banks to issue rupee cards, but also allows their usage for settlements in both India and Mauritius. This global expansion of UPI began at the Eiffel Tower in Paris on February 2nd during the Republic Day. This move positions India as a leader in fintech innovation on the international stage, fostering stronger ties and digital connectivity between nations. Subhashish Govekar and Shivani Sangilkar for Goa 365. We will take a short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. And now for some weather. According to the weather department, the weather is expected to remain dry at least until February 18th. Haze or shallow fog is likely at isolated places in the morning on Tuesday. However, no significant change in minimum temperature is expected for the next four to five days. Here's more on the weather. The weather forecast for Goa looks stable with dry conditions set to persist. Residents can expect weather to remain pleasant with clear skies and no weather warnings on the horizon. The maximum and minimum temperatures on Tuesday has been forecasted to hover around 33 degrees Celsius and 22 degrees Celsius respectively. Additionally, no weather alert has been issued for the Govan coast and boat owners can go about their business as usual. Pleasant dry weather on Tuesday. Dry weather to persist until February 18th. Haze, shallow fog at isolated places. No weather warnings at least until February 16th. Minimum temperatures to remain stable. Maximum and minimum temperatures on Tuesday, 33 degrees Celsius and 22 degrees Celsius respectively. No weather alert for the Govan coast. Bureau report Goa 365 with inputs from IMD. With that, we have come to the end of this news bulletin. For more news and updates, log on to our website www.goa365.tv. Follow us on Facebook and YouTube, Goa365TV. Take care, stay safe and keep watching Goa365.